Hey guys, what's up? So today I would like to do today's regular sh show review. Go, you spark. Okay, um, Jim Blaskowski, yeah, Jim Blaskowski. Frank Blaskowski, actually, J Jim Blaskowski, whatever his name. Actually, I know when I was actually looking at his name. Actually, he was voiced by D. Roe Craig Smith. You know the guy from what's like Dying Light. Okay, anyways, let's review this episode. So yeah, the story starts where I. So no, actually, the story starts where Rigby actually had to get something done. He went past high. Went back to his high school. That actually, Rigby went back to his high school. So yeah, basically he re goes back to his high school to pass one last test, which is his gym test, actually. <sighs> oh, and, and for anyone who don't know how it started, I will highly recommend watching regular show epis, the regular show, the movie before before I explain, before I continue. Okay, never mind. Okay, before I before I explain mostly the episode, I do highly recommend that if you watch the movie. The regular show, the movie, and I, the Eileen Clan, which is actually an episode that I do, and explaining some at least some things. And yes, he mentioned China. He, I mean, yes, he did mention Shin Hello China, which is actually basically an episode that actually, changed, which is done with names. Yeah, I thought this episode was the first time where basically no Vincent's name Dunwood, but do you get the idea? So basically, um, let me explain the episode. So yeah, after he went to the G school, after finishing all three tests. So he has one last thing to finish, gym class. So, Rigby needs to finish his gym class before he can actually do it. And yeah, basically he needs to. So, principal. So then, the principal has something to t do. Basically, the principal has a minor issue, basically. The principal. Well, basically, he told all everyone that did you. The coach is not here because he actually won one million on a lottery. Wow, he won a lottery. Yeah, because he don't want to stand in this gym anymore. So then, Jim Bosco, Francis Jim Bosco, and then he has his brother or something. You know, actually, was here. And basically, and yes, Rigby having flashbacks. Of his previous bullies, you, 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 he wasn't. This is not his first time first appearance. This is actually from the regular show, the movie. But I don't want to spoil the movie. So yeah, five year championship. So basically, we get to see some footage of everything where Rigby bullies up and hurting him. Yes, and then uh, in the flat, and after the flashback, he. Okay, then they do some. Basically, gym exercises and including washing his car. Okay, that's not related because he just wanted to get to clean his cars right about now. Or something. Then, talk to the. Rick being wants to go to talk to the principal, but then having problems. Try to not tell anyone and try to keep a secret. And then. It failed. And then he, like. And yes, it was a fail. Then, noticing, realized that Rigby will clean his dishes. So then, we go back to the home and basically he do do something else. So he got a something called food rush. They have a plan with a food rush. If you don't know what that is, basically there's a fin you go. You, it's a starting line game. Basically, you must bring your food. You must go to food rush. You have to bring your favorite food restaurant. Then after that, at they had to go. So basically, they choose Cheezers, the bad bad part of town, which. Which feels like a stupid name. Basically, okay, who will call this a bad town? Oh, before I continue, I forgot to say that Eileen's plan also confirms that the show takes place, season 7, takes place in 2015, which is last year. So, yeah, let me continue. Okay, let's go continue. After they tried to go get some weapons, I uh, know, actually, uh, sorry, wrong script. Wrong, oh, okay, wrong review. Anyways, trying to get their cheaters, they also, one of them actually, so yeah. After some montages and everything, after talking about the plan, and also training montages, and Benson's 
brother actually came in and basically borrows his car due to an incident with his the car. Anyways, after basically with some montages and everything, yeah. And so then we go to see that Jim Bosco, Francis Jim Bosco, just forgets to, the mobile is not working, isn't busy, and then Re, more guy Ruby, uh, Ruby has a speed dial ability, which uh, he has a good speed dial, and then call the restaurant saying, and actually just calling and starting the race. Okay. I did like the action scenes of the running, driving scenes and the high pumping music that actually plays out. Really kind of great episode, actually. But, um, for, uh, I need to tell some. Before I continue, I would like to say, if someone makes a game based on the scene, do it and help me make this scene a reality. Makes this game in. Help me make a get flash game or whatever game based on this scene and uh, make it as a game where basically you can play different drivers and get the meal. That'll be the best idea. I wonder what happens when you put this concept on in real life. Hmm. Send your videos below if you think this is a good idea. Anyways, after what we get, after we get an epic ch cheese, after they get their cheesers, including this guy, including the guy on the first day of his job, grabbing his two, their cheese cheesy orders, and then go. Back yes. So yeah, the race yeah it started yeah I get the idea. Then we go to basically after. I'm gonna sneeze. I want to go get this video down. I want to sneeze. Okay, that's what I'm saying. After we get in the newest chain scene, we get to see they go over the they go went to here. Okay, no, actually they went to the fin they had to get to the finish line. Then suddenly Rippy wins and the jar. And then okay. so gonna cry over. A problem with, it. but then he needs to get up and then show, give Ruby advice to get over it. Then sign, take one last one, one of the gym test, and then, and then they do an epic pop, froze the jump, up sequence of the yeah you get the idea, and basically that's it of the episode. What do I think about this episode? Really kind of good actually. I like that Rigby actually passes high school. Since he actually failed after a one simple incident happened, and basically he's already passed high school. I'm so happy with the break B actually getting past his high school, and basically, I'm so happy. So, before we ever end the video here, I would like to say something of a special announcement to make. Now, in my, one of my reviews I actually done earlier, actually, which, what was, that, what was that review I, oh yeah, that review I made a couple of months ago. I would like to actually want to talk about if I will do a contest, but actually do. Actually, I'm going to be putting the Q&As open, and no, I'm not going to read bad comments, and I'm just going to delete your comment if it's if it's bad, by the way. Please note, we will also delete your comments because we think maybe inappropriate or offensive to, to me or any... To this. But anyways, I will end the video right here. Oh yeah, my final ratings. Ah, uh, yeah, I did like it, the scenes. I did like the high pop music action scenes. Hmm, no falls, so 10 out of 10, and my approval. Okay, bye.